50 million tons of food is wasted every year in the UK. Most of this waste ends up in ever enlarging landfill sites where it will rot in smell for eternity. Much of this waste comes directly from supermarkets that throw away food due to strict best before dates or overstocking. It is rumoured that whole feasts of perfectly edible food can be found chucked out in a city's back alleys and bins. Freegans are people that aim to combat this waste problem by reclaiming and living off the binned food. We tracked down four people of the Freegan persuasion and asked them to host a week of dinner parties to find out if there really are treasures in the city's trash. This week's host is Art Cook, a third year English Literature student at Edinburgh University. Art is a novice freegan, so employed the help of fellow Come Scavenge With Me contestants, Lily and Beater, to go skipping for the ingredients that will make up his meal on Saturday night. Skipping is freegan slang for the process of looking for usable items in bins or skips. Lily took Art to one of the most reliable spots in Edinburgh, where she even bumped into some freegan friends. You test the bags, oh. and the heavier they are, they usually they have contain food waste. Oh my god! You see, there's a, a display until date. That means if the shop hasn't managed to sell this item by that date, they'll throw it away. Um, not depending if it's bad or good, just because they couldn't sell it by that time. It's ridiculous. Yeah. Oh, I love these. With the bins proving to be fruitful and the atmosphere friendly, it seemed like plain sailing for Art's waste-free banquet. Until an excitable chap happened upon the evening's proceedings. Why are you filming? Don't make it up. Fuck with me, pal. Don't fuck with me, pal. Put that down. We are feeding the fucking homeless. We're not making a fucking film about it. It's not a fucking documentary. It's not. It's about people's lives. You fucks. His heart was in the right place, but his temper and his judgment wasn't. And just like that, he was a lovely and very knowledgeable, passionate guy. An awful lot of supermarkets across the UK who do not respect the fact that the homeless are fucking starving. Something like £300,000 worth of food is put into the bins every single day across the United Kingdom. Now that Ridiculous. food is obviously out of date. I ate uh, eight week out of date eggs not that long ago. Eight week out of date eggs not that long ago and they were absolutely but uh, it, none of that food is uh, unfit to eat. These people at a local level are cool with that nevertheless at an executive level they do not want this food to go out because there's legislation in place that says that the best buy and the out of date food is not fit for human consumption. That is total bollocks. And with that the gang headed off into the night to gather the thoughts and collect their findings. It's the day of the meal and preparations get underway. After sleeping on menu ideas and considering the ingredients at hand, Art is going for a starter of a mixed salad with fancy garlic bread <laughs> and main course of dauphinois potatoes with sage stuffing and a dessert of bread and butter pudding. After a day of vigorous culinary endeavour of the least wasteful nature, Art is ready to welcome his guests.
Their appetites whetted and beers in hand, the meal kicked off with that gargantuan salad. I mean, it's so fresh, the salads, and to think that it would be thrown away is just ridiculous. Mm. It's still good. It's good. Yeah, potatoes, the quinoa with fruit man. Oh my god, who's there? Yeah. Was that the potatoes? Yeah, so it was more than that. Yeah, this is our bread and butter pudding <laughs> with the bread <laughs> that we got at Waitrose. We just went skipping once and talked to some neighbors that have leftovers and we made these huge meals and fed one, two, three, four, five, six, six people. So with the meal going down a treat, there's one question left to ask. Just what do they have in mind for the next Come Scavenge With Me meal? Bread parties. <laughs> Ha <laughs> <laughs>